the Samsung Galaxy A54 smartphone. I'm going to show you several ways how you can turn off or restart. So the first way is the most common way. It's a two key combination though, okay? It's volume down, power button. You want to press both at the same time and hold it until the power off menu appears, okay? If you just click volume down and power both quickly one time like that, it's going to take a screenshot. So again, volume down, power, press and hold, and just wait till the power off menu appears. We can power off or we can restart, okay? Now you guys are probably trying to hold the power button like this and it wakes up this Bixby, okay? We, you can change that too. If we go down, um, bring up the power off menu again, uh, volume down, power button, press and hold, and this pops up and down here it says side key settings, okay? So if we tap on that right there, and then press and hold the power button wakes up Bixby. However, we can do power off menu. So now when we press and hold just the power button, the power off menu will appear here. Okay, I'm going to put it back on the Bixby. Another way you can turn off or restart is log into your phone, swipe down notifications, and then we want to slide down one more time. As I slide down, you can see the power button right there. All right, tap on that power button, and we're back here again, okay? And let me show you another way um, how to restart it, okay? If your phone's like frozen or you can't uh, restart or power down the traditional way by bringing up the power off menu, maybe your screen's not working, you can always force a restart as well. How you do that, it's simple. Two key combination, volume down, power button, okay? Same two buttons to bring up the power off menu, okay? However, this time we're gonna hold it until we see a Samsung logo appear, okay? So volume down, power button, ready, set, go. Press and hold, just keep on holding. Don't worry about what's happening to the screen here. We're gonna to continue to hold until we see a Samsung logo, okay? So it's basically forced restarting my phone now. It just turned off, oh, Samsung logo right there. Go ahead and let go and let it boot up normally. And there you go, you just performed a, a forced restart. Any other questions or issues, just uh, comment below. Good luck, guys.